Good day, YouTube. This is just a, yet another uh, silly and unsubstantiated video claim uh, with a bit of a RAM comparison video between Linux Mint 21 on the left hand side, the XFCE edition, as we can see there, and uh, Linux Mint, uh, the well the current release, Linux Mint 20.3 on the right hand side, also XFCE. So it does need to be noted that uh, Linux Mint at the time of recording of this video is kind of in the, the alpha slash beta stage, They more, more so alpha actually to be honest. So so uh, it's not a fair comparison. It might not be optimized, you know, that well. But let's get into the stats anyway. So here we go. So we've got uh, two operating systems. One's the latest. One's the alpha slash beta of the the upcoming uh, release. And one CPU assigned to each of them, and the RAM there as well. So the CPU is nicely idling out for each, as we'd expect. Now the RAM is is quite different here. So we can see there's about 586 megabytes of RAM usage on boot up for Linux Mint 21 XFCE edition, whereas Linux Mint 20.3 XFCE edition current release is 479 megabytes of RAM. Kind of really hard to read, but a decent 100 megabytes RAM more. Now we always may be assumed that that was going to be the case there. But uh, the reason for all that is uh, you've basically got a, a, a newer front end uh, there. So newer version in of application, sometimes the kernel, which isn't showing up there for whatever reason. But uh, the newer the operating system, basically across the board, whether it's Windows, Mac, Linux, it's always going to be a little bit bigger, a lot more lines of code, uh, all uh, kernel code, for instance, that kind of thing there. But that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, so I'll just leave it at that for now. I'll certainly do a follow-up real video later. But um, yeah, yeah, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button. And I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Cheers.